In business, the application of maths goes far beyond using simple arithmetic for calculating profit and loss. Maths gets used in a variety of different ways to help make companies more successful, from financial planning to maximising efficiency, and even in things like combating crime. Although yet to feature in a hard-hitting TV drama series, the forensic accountant is just as important as any other crime scene investigator. Financial fraud costs the UK over £30 billion a year. Cases often involve falsifying records or making illicit transactions. They can be notoriously difficult to spot and even more difficult to make comprehensible to a jury. Forensic accountants need to be skilled mathematicians with a good understanding of probability if fraudsters are to be brought to justice. Of course, one of the best ways to fight crime is to prevent it from happening in the first place. That's where encryption comes in. It's estimated that $75 billion a day are transmitted electronically around the world. Imagine what the consequences would be if e-commerce wasn't absolutely secure. Mathematicians have been cracking codes for centuries, but now they've come up with one, known as RSA encryption, that would take over a thousand years to crack using technology that's currently available. It's all based around the products of really large prime numbers, and until quantum computers have been invented or someone comes up with another way to easily factorise huge numbers, our transactions online are incredibly secure. Far riskier are the everyday uncertainties that businesses can face. Natural disasters, disease, terrorism and foreign political upheaval to name but a few. Maths can't tell us what's around the next corner but it can be used to assess the probability of unfavourable events and estimate the severity of their consequences. Risk analysis has a vital role in business and can turn a potential disaster into a mere mishap. Operational research is the name given to the science of prediction and decision making, based on mathematical analyses of past data. It was first used with great success during World War II by the Royal Navy to determine the optimal size of Atlantic convoys. Have you ever wondered why supermarkets bother with loyalty cards like Tesco's Club Card or Sainsbury's Nectar Card? These cards enable the supermarkets to track what their customers are buying creating huge amounts of data for operational researchers to work with. They use statistics to search for patterns in the data, attempting to predict how customers will behave in the future. Businesses can thereby improve their services and lower their costs. Operational research is sometimes called the science of the better. Being successful in business is not just about having the best product, it's about having that product at the best price and marketing it in the right place at the right time. Maths helps businesses know what people want so they can give that to them, how and when they want it. 